Hello and welcome for our new Vintage Chronicle. Today we will describe the 1984 Imperial Shuttle. Released in 1984, Imperial Shuttle is the third largest vehicle designed by Kenner into the Star Wars toy line. Box is designed with two colorful printed sides and four drawing printed sides. Inside package you will find one cardboard with one vertical stabilizer, two cardboard insert with one base vehicle, two bags of accessories, one label sheet, one instruction sheet, one catalog. Inside first bag here you will find two landing gear, one handle, one side hatch door, one canopy, one window canopy, one battery compartment door, one rear cannon. Inside second baggy you will find one small section ramp, one large section ramp, four top wing guns, two front cannons. Imperial shuttle is designed with two swing wings, two seat canopy, one access ramp, one room, and two foldable landing gear. Top cockpit canopy opens to access two seats cockpit and place two action figures. Cockpit control panel is well detailed with labels. Underside ramp can be lowered or extend to leave action figures access to the shuttle. Cabin and underside room are connected through a small corridor. Open side hatch door to access inside room and place action figures. Top wing side cannon swing up and down. Rear battery compartment opens by pressing top center and pull down battery door to place two AA battery. Press dark gray button for laser sound. Two landing gears move manually. Pull trigger handle underside vehicle to release wings. Return wings to up position manually. I hope this review has been an interest to you and feel free to subscribe for more videos and thank you for watching Vintage Chronicle.